thank you for clicking on the video and I hope everyone is doing really well. So it has been a while since I have done a thrift store try on haul video and yesterday I had the hankering to go to the thrift store. I don't need new clothes. I just felt like going to the thrift store. So I did. I also happen to be feeling rather bloated today, not feeling my best, haven't been feeling my best physically, you know, body image issues. Just haven't been feeling myself for the past couple days. So what better time than now to show myself trying on clothes that make me super insecure because when I have the idea to make one of these videos, I try to focus on getting things that in my mind, if I had the perfect body, I would be able to wear so therefore I buy those things because there is no such thing as the perfect body for clothes clothes are for the body not the other way around so I'm just gonna jump right into it I know I look fabulous <laughs> this is what I sleep in if you were wondering all right so first up is a sweater in the shade of black and I bought it cuz the sleeves are cool Now this item obviously is just a, you know, classic sweater with a little bit of personality, a little touch. This is obviously not one of the items that I would feel insecure about wearing. Probably wear it to work. Could wear it really anywhere. It's just a sweater, okay? This next item is one of those things that I bought because it's ugly and I love ugly things, so let me show you. I don't, I don't know. It's weird. I don't know what it means, but I like it. The sleeves are awkward. Like, what length would you call this? Awkward, awkward length. Awkward length here too. I've seen my disgusting <laughs> sweatpants that I've had for like 15 years and I refuse to get rid of, even though the tie is broken. Okay, this next item is one of those things that it's like, that's weird. I would feel really insecure wearing that. I wish I could wear that. Oh wait, I can, because I have a human body and the human body is meant to be covered in clothes. It's so weird that I can't figure out how the heck this works. And I'm just gonna hold it up and then we'll figure out how to put it on. This, what is it, you may be asking? It's a shirt. Obviously. Oh. 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 Look at that. Figured it out. Mystery solved. So last shirt before getting into other items. It would not be a classic thrift store haul without an oversized flannel. It's very big, it's very soft, it's black and white. Another thing that I can't pass up is onesies. I don't know why, I don't know how, but I have gotten obsessed with onesies. And I actually just saved one very similar to this on my Amazon wish list. Then I saw this one and it was like, Two dollars. Ooh, in the back. Is like, I think this is like a dance leotard. <gasps> I should go get my dance shoes. And another onesie. Ooh, yeah. This is the this is the one that might not <laughs> go up over the hips and the legs, the thighs, the butt. I just bought it because. I like grommets, obviously, the sweater from the beginning, I'm in it. This is very interesting because it's very snug, as it should be. It's also a size too small, but but the crotch, you can't see and I'm not gonna show you, but it's, the crotch is like very long. <laughs> not sure what body type they were going for. I don't even know. Last in the realm of one piece garments, bought a romper and you're gonna be very surprised because it's 
got pink. So this one is a size too big, but I do not care because I could just pin it in the back, call it a day. And I bought it because it's got this cute little tie. Oh my gosh, I'm adorable. I'm so precious. The other thing about buying things that are too big, you can make them off the shoulder. Oh my gosh. Getting in and out of that onesie is a workout. I'm exhausted now. All right. It looks like a dress, but it's shorts. I dance like a white person. I don't know where I'm gonna wear it or why I bought it. I was looking at the dresses and then I was like, you don't even wear dresses, what are you doing? And then I saw this one and I thought, you know, why not? It's a thrift store. If not, I can take it apart and use the fabric for something. Next up, bottoms. They have zippers, drawstring, stretchy waistband, all right? If you're feeling a little saucy, you can pull them up higher and it shows the underbutt. So, pair of shorts, just in time for winter. Now, this next item is a skirt. It is going to require some alterations. It will be taken in and shortened because if I wear it where it's supposed to wear, ooh, it almost touches the knee, ew. But I bought it because I like the buttons down the front. I have a jean skirt that does the same thing with the buttons down the front that I really like and it's getting old probably will have to be retired soon, so a nice replacement is a good idea. But yeah, this is about, I think it's like two or three sizes too big. So I'll just take it in, shorten it, and then it'll be perfect. Last item, a pair of very dusty shorts with a scallop hemline. Very feminine, very adorable, and fingers crossed, they fit. Oh, isn't that precious? That concludes what I bought at the thrift store. Am I still insecure about my body? Yes. Does it matter? No. Am I still gonna wear clothes that I like? Yes. Are people gonna judge me? Yes, but that is, that is neither here nor there. That is for other reasons. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. If you did not enjoy it, you can give it a thumbs down. That is cool too, I don't mind. If you're not subscribed already, please consider subscribing and be sure to hit the notification bell to stay notified of all future uploads. If you have any comments, questions, video suggestions, anything at all, feel free to leave that in the comment section below. Be sure to go follow me over on Instagram and I'll see you next time. Bye.